Hey guys, I'm back with another video and I wanted to do a video on the Shea Moisture line the for high porosity. I bought with my own money, I actually purchased these from Target, the uh, Shea Moisture High Porosity Moisture Seal Shampoo, the Co-Wash, and the Moisture Seal Mask. I bought these three. I looked up something just so I can give you guys a straight definition and not like giving you my words. So this says, I'll put the picture on the screen as well. But this says, uh, porosity refers to how well moisture penetrates the cuticle layer of the hair of the hair shaft. In low porosity hair, the cuticles are resistant and repel moisture. In normal hair, the cuticles lay flat, allowing moisture to penetrate the hair. And with high porosity hair, the cuticles are raised and moisture easily escapes the hair shaft. So I definitely have high porosity hair because my hair lacks so much moisture. Like I have to deep condition a lot. I deep condition probably every three days. Um, also, another way you can tell if you have high porosity hair is when you wash your hair and your hair dries really fast. So I know I have high porosity hair because at first I was thinking maybe I just got the wrong type of shampoo, you know, the wrong kind. Maybe I needed low porosity, but I have high porosity hair. So on to the review. These things suck. Like, okay, this probably is the best one. The, um, the mask. And you guys can see that I actually use this. I use this for a good month, month and a half. It looks like this in the inside. I actually used this before I did a review on it. The, the Moisture Seal Mask is actually pretty good. I put it on when I get, like I wash, always wash my hair in the shower. So I put it on when I, um, at the end of my shower, I put a bag on, on my head. And, or you know a shower cap on my head and I get out sometimes I sleep overnight with it on or sometimes I'll wash it out maybe an hour later this actually kind, kind of moisturizes my hair but I would prefer to go back to the regular Shea Moisture that I was using because this is it just wasn't I don't like the smell of it either it smells like flowers or something yeah it smells like straight up flowers like potpourri or something so as far as the shampoo, this stuff sucks, guys. Like, I don't use shampoo often. Like, I shampoo my hair probably once a week, if that. So, it smells like potpourri. <laughs> but I want to. I wish, wish I could show you. So it's basically like down here. So that shows. I shampoo like once a week, if that, and that shows you how much I actually use this stuff. So. This stuff it did nothing. Like literally when I put it in my hair, my hair was, after I washed it out, my hair was like so brittle, so dry. It added no moisture whatsoever to my hair. Like it really was horrible. It, it was horrible. So this, um, as you can see, is all the way down here because I co-wash my hair more than I shampoo my hair. So I'll probably co-wash every three days when it's time for me. When I'm going to do a deep condition, I will co-wash my hair. So this, I don't even know what to say about it. Like, it did nothing. <laughs> it did absolutely nothing. Like, it added no type of moisture to my hair. Like, this line really was not a good line. And I'm a huge Shea Moisture fan. I mean, like, I live for their products but this one right here no i i will never repurchase this again like it's just it was not what's up like it is not the business at all at all like i don't know i will never repurchase. And, and it could just be my hair because people I've, I've watched reviews of this before i bought it and people were like they said they swear by this stuff First of all, one thing I can't get over is the way it freaking smells. I, I smell, I was walking around smelling like somebody grabbed my bath on. Like potpourri. Like straight up potpourri. So I would never use this again. So that's it for this review, guys. I mean, I didn't like the product. 
um again it could just be my hair that just did not like this product but i hope you guys enjoyed this review make sure you give me a thumbs up and if you're new to the channel please go ahead and push the subscribe button below and again thank you guys for watching i'll talk to you in the next video